And that heavy rain in the North Bay has taken a toll on one resident who's still trying to rebuild after the devastating Tubbs fire. That fire in 2017 killed 22 people. It destroyed 5,000 homes. Ground Force Teresa Stasio has more. Jesse Ulatalo has a remarkable attitude. With all of these rains that have happened here in the North Bay, it's caused a lot of damage to his property. See for yourself. That is the tractor stuck on Jesse Ulatalo's property. As you can see, it is buried deep in the mud. Ulatalo says that the problems have been growing with the ferocious rains in January as he tried to finish rebuilding his home following the devastating Tubbs fire back in 2017. Just had drainage about 60 feet put behind my house. Four inches of rain clogged the drain immediately, and I have about a three-foot dip in my property all along that 60 feet on top of where the drain was supposed to go. So tractors and nothing will be able to get out there for at least a couple of months because it's so wet and it's going to continue to rain. Ulatalo says that most of the damage affected the landscaping around his rebuilt home. Yeah, just got in in um, May of last year, so the house is still kind of getting completed. There's no real landscaping yet, and this was kind of the first step towards it, and it's a step forward and a step backwards at the same time. Despite the widespread challenges, Ulatalo says he is optimistic and takes it all in stride with living in Santa Rosa's countryside. Oh, I love the area. I couldn't be happier to be here. So, you know, what, what comes with the rain is what happens, and I'll live through it and continue to rebuild, and we'll be back better than ever in no time. And, of course, we have more rains that are expected next week. So it's going to be some time before any work can continue. Here in Santa Rosa, Teresa Stasio, Cron 4 News.